100%, I'm no reach around guy, okay? I'm here to do a review for you guys. I had a company called MTRVR send me this uh, camping chair. Yes, it's here. Um, it, the first thing that drew me to this was it said 600 pounds. Yes, you can have a family of three. You can have you, your wife, your girlfriend. Not at the same time though. Maybe your wife and girlfriend if, if it's like that, but that's another story. But maybe you, your significant other, and their child all in the same seat, folks, in this little bitty compact seat. Uh, I'm gonna give you a close-up uh, that I'm gonna uh, take videos later of this chair right now. Uh, I'm gonna open it up for you guys, but look, it opens up really simple. Look, it already locks into place. Just make sure this is locked in, and it already is. There's a, there's a ring on the bottom that you just pull. Uh, you set this up. Pull this out, pull this out. Like I said, this is the first time I just got it out, the box. It has a, a high back and it's low. So even in a two person tent that I have, that's a low ceiling like this, this still sits in there. It has a built-in pillow. Uh, and I, uh, I think I did say aluminum frame. It is lightweight, it's about six pounds. Uh, they have the feet at the bottom, so you can use it indoors, which I'll show you here later on. Uh, but uh, you can use this outside as well. Uh, let me see. Let's see if it fits me. I'm uh, 245 today. Oh yes, folks. The only thing I don't I, I don't like about this, and I'm just being honest. Sorry, MTRVR. It doesn't have like an armrest. I like an armrest and I like something to sit in my a drink on. You know, I don't I don't drink alcohol anymore, but a coffee, you know. Um, it does have a side pocket for a phone. It has a bigger side pocket here for a bigger phone. But I guess you can put a drink in there, but it's kind of uncomfortable for that. Uh, other than that, uh, the camping chair that sits straight up. Uh, I'm not a fan of those because your back starts hurting and you want to sit back and enjoy the fire. You can kick back. This is very, very comfortable. Uh, if you're doing it like this, instead of not having an armrest, you want to sit back. If you want to look at the stars without having your head looking up like this in a regular chair, you're already there, folks. Uh, I got the built-in pillow, so I really, really like that. Uh, it's not too high off the ground. And I'm a short person and my feet ain't dangling from the chair. Uh, very, very nice. If you look in descriptions, uh, I'm going to put the link to the company and you can check out the pricing. And uh, it goes to Amazon. And I think they might have a coupon in there. I'm not really sure right now. But if you check in descriptions, uh, you can go there and check it out. Uh, but this right now, if you're not worried about having a drink, you've got a, a little, little uh, camping fold-out. A table like I have you can set it here and set a drink on uh, but I really like the material the the backing and I'll show you on the, on the, on the phone right now uh, but the backing 
how the quality of this material is. This right here is this mesh in the back. This mesh is really high quality. I'm looking at the stitching. The stitching is really good. I don't see any loose threads uh, nowhere in here. It does have reinforcement and it has a screw in here so it's not gonna pop out right there. Uh, the frame is durable. It has two locking on each side, two locking clasps. Uh, here is the bag close up. Like I said, look at the stitching. The stitching is impeccable. Uh, really a fan of that. You don't see any loose threads anywhere. Uh, that is a, a bonus. And the very bottom, I do have to tell you guys, I did not think that this was going to be that sturdy. But look at the locking mechanisms here. They lock right there. Uh, there's a name brand on there. Okay, that's all the testing out here that I'm doing on this. Uh, I'm highly recommending this uh, if you're not worried about the armrest. Uh, that, that drops it down to an eight out of 10. Um, it would be probably almost a 10 if it had the armrest with a cup holder. Uh, that would be very, very uh, appreciative. Uh, but eight out of 10, uh, I'm gonna go inside and uh, finish this video now and we can uh, wrap it up with uh, the warranty they offer on this as well. Okay, we are inside of Walmart, and this is one of my favorite aisles, the camping aisle. Um, and what's the better, better option to try this out in here? I'll show you how fast this unfolds. It's locked in place. It's locked. It's locked. Okay. I thought about it on the ride over here. Um, justice. I thought about it on the ride over here. Uh, this chair, I give it a 10 out of comfort. It's very comfortable. I give it a 10. I give it a 10 on the quality. Um, very, very quality. And the capacity of the uh, bag. It's not like a regular camping bag. It actually fits down to here. And it's uh, 600 pounds. So with all that said, I would have gave it a 10, but the no armrest still. I do like a cup. They do have a reach around thing. 100%, I'm no reach around guy, okay? Um, but uh, I can still give it an eight. I'm firmly on the eight. Uh, but for me, I'm just saying, I'm sorry, MTRVR. Even though I gave it an eight out of 10, I wouldn't, I wouldn't buy it personally because of no armrest just give my honest review but for anybody that doesn't really care about having a, a cup holder it's a 10 i mean i would definitely get it uh, but for me um <clears throat> sorry i would not uh, hopefully this does not uh, taint my um professionalism uh, with your company um, i do i do enjoy the chair again i just need a, a, some kind of cup holder but with that said, I'm gonna get out of here before they arrest me.
you now and know what the future bring all the highs and lows